taking the top two guys, first and second fellas. First and second place, ladies and gentlemen, will go through into the final. Everyone's at their logs. Best luck, fellas. You are now in the starter's hand. Axman, stand by for start. Get ready. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. All the way there, ladies and gentlemen. John Coffey going exceptionally well there on stand number one. Probably had the bottom of his rod. Bit of a knock there or something like that. So he decided to walk away rather than risking uh, breaking a racing axe. And the top two guys will go through. It's going to be stands one and two, I reckon, by look at things. They've got the pace on them. And it's going to be dragged by on stand number three, followed by... Johnny's struggling to get his rug up there. And there you go, looks like he's going to be stand two and three and one. We'll have a look at that, the video ladies and gentlemen, just a sec. For the wet undergrowth that we have here, ladies and gentlemen, the boys will tend to wear a cricket's pipe on the standing block so they get grip and control. But when they go to the underhands, of course, they're too grippy and you can't move your feet, so they take them off and go for the old trusty Dunlop volley. Hello to Mick Curley over there in the crowd. Haven't seen you for a long time, mate. You're home ground. Should be on the other side of the fence. Bit of lube going on the axe. Front marker will start off three. Our back marker, Macker, will be off 21. He says start the cop. I'm ready to go. So, gentlemen, best of luck. You are now the starter's hand. Excellent. Stand by for start. Get ready. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one. Macker going exceptionally well there on the front section. He's around with everybody else in the reverse side. Lucky on before we have the first two ladies to qualify to go into the final. And getting very, very close indeed. Here's Willie Hoyle on stand number five. He's going to be the first one. And uh, I think uh, Macintosh is going to qualify in second place there. Pretty safe to say. Josh Lane in third, which is no, uh, not required. So Willie Hoyle and David McIntosh in that order if it becomes official. Yeah, give those guys a big round of applause. Well done indeed. Now the sounding of the whistle gives me uh, the all clear to announce the place. So congratulations to stand number five, Willie Hoyle winning the competition of six seconds behind. With an outstanding performance on number one seat, David McIntosh, our back marker. He's qualified in second place on 21 seconds behind.